to the left, to the right. He's out of sight. I'm about to take it right down the pipe. Hit it through the gap. Bring it back. I run it back. And he's been the best pitcher in the National League this year. Part of the season and a 1.95 ERA as he starts action today. There's a pitch on the outside corner. He gets in base for the Cardinals tonight. Sosa and Kisner. Popped up off third. Long run Anderson has room to make the catch. And De La Cruz will hit ninth for the Marlins. So when they get back up to the box, uh, back for eight in this series, extra base hits in four in a row. Swings over the top of that one, and it's a ball and a strike. Times this season for Sandy Alcantara. Come a dog on the mouth, like a, like he is mean. Yeah, he doesn't want to. I've said it a lot. He is a, a great human being, a great individual. But now on game days, one ball and two strikes to Carlson. Ground ball left side. Miggy the only one there. Sliding play. Got him at first. Miguel Rojas get to his feet so quick and make a strong throw. Just a spectacular play by Miguel Rojas. Really, in the last what would you say week, week and a half? Yeah, he's together been, a, a handful of. Them. Yeah, he's been flashing some leather. Far. Ball and a strike. That went down and away. Gave him so much credit, but it's like. Hey, Goldschmidt, you're hitting 347. <laughs> and a 2 2 pitch coming. Fouled away again. Yeah, uh, this is not fun. Swing and a miss. That one at 98 miles an hour. A one. Is that Illinois out there? Good question. I think it's misery. Missouri, Missouri. card all set now by the way from that first inning uh, fiasco popped up foul territory Anderson ranging in front of the dugout gets underneath it yeah, takes just a little bit low he had a out toward right field Avi Garcia will not get there and one hops off the wall Yepes on his way to second base with a one-out double. And for the Cardinals in this series, their sixth double to go along with a couple of triples and three home runs. And now this one, a fly ball out to deep left field. But De La Cruz gets there, and Yepes has to retreat. Long out off the bat of Lars Nootvar, two away for that. Because as we've discussed, he is not in it for the strikeouts. Ground ball, backhanded by Birdie, makes the play. And Connor Capel is retired. Sandy through two, scoreless. <laughs> Playing baseball, likes fishing, going on the jet ski. And his favorite Marlin player is Jazz Chisholm Jr. This one to the left side, off the glove of Brian Anderson. Should be an infield single for Edmundo Sosa. And just let it rip, and they thought that's how they could have success. Or maybe they know Sandy really well, right, Jessica Blaylock? <laughs> you know? That's a good fib, right? Isn't aren't there good fib? Sure. That is a foul ball just out of the reach of Garrett Cooper. No one knows yourself better than you do, and Sandy's part of that. Runner goes, and that one fouled away at home plate. Gotcha. Oh, two fouled away. How long have you been out of the minor leagues? More than seven years. Oh, two. Kind of did right there, didn't he? 98 miles. In. Top of the order. Inside corner for a strike to Donna. A strike. A few names that we haven't really mentioned too much. Paul DeYoung is in the minor leagues. Corey Dickerson's in. Calling the pitches that the manager's calling the pitches. No, they're calling the run game. And so the, what I mean by calling the run 
Sosa goes, pitch is low, throw to second. Not in time. Position. And the pitch to Donovan is grounded softly to the right side. Cooper's got it. Can't get it out of his glove. Donovan is aboard, and it's first and third. And one away. You saw a little fake steal right there, Paul. That's just to kind of see. And Carlson lifts one out to right field. Just in front of the track, Garcia makes the catch. His throw goes to second. The run will score on the sack fly. Ball one to go. Sack fly. Donovan, your runner at first base. That one misses outside. Two balls, no strikes. Outside. So he would have gotten a third anyway. Therefore, scored on the sack fly. But you're saying it would have been two outs in the inning. It's nice to come to St. Louis, even though it's a little bit warmer today. It is not one of those typical summer Midwest St. Louis nights where it's 312 degrees and humid. It's just a little toasty today, and actually not that bad. A little, little breeze up here now, so it's all good. Well, we got the fan with. Yeah, and hey, listen, if it was 95 degrees and humid, I still don't know if you'd see Sandy sweat. One unearned run against him here tonight. Arenado holds up. This is when. Maddenly has to come out there to try to take the ball away from Sandy. Or he has to tell him, hey, unless the game's over. High pop on the infield. Cooper coming in near the mound will make the catch, and that's the first out. Straight starts of going at least seven innings. Last Marlin to do that, Dontrell Willis. But he seems to get stronger as the night goes on. And if you just happened to pop Alcantara at nine. Jacob DeGrom had an eight game run back in 2019. This one a bouncer towards short. Rojas makes the play to retire Yepes. You need to be able to take advantage. That's why you see those early swings. And it always pitch count range. And you do that by having six and seven and eight and ten pitch innings all night long. You a fan of the changeup from Sandy Alcantara. Slow tapper toward third. And Newt Barr was slow to get out of the box, but that was a fair ball. He was well known for bringing the love of the game to younger fans, and he was also well known for his trinket collection. So much more. Now, you can only see this if you take a tour of the ballpark, so be sure to put that on your... We talked about it uh, earlier this week. We talked about baseball heaven and some of the older ballparks, the Wrigley's and the Fenway. In front of this, what do you call it? piece of furniture or you, this the shelf or uh, credenza it was I was like why are there so many things of history in here to the right side for Coop feeds out contra for the first out. our director of course yes I don't know what a hutch is but I can tell you that credenza words just wait till Christmas I'll get you the uh, word of the day calendar yeah It'll be a new one every day yes but that Does that work that works well. Now toward right center field, long way back. And off the glove of Sanchez. Sosa racing toward third. Birdie's got it. His throw is late. But here, trying to keep a run off the board. It would be the tying rubs to get ground balls and have double plays. Chase that one. Four plus three equals two. Yeah, that's right. That's his tattoo. Yeah. But he didn't, he did like six. Take that, math majors. That one take. Three one. Misses low for the first three ball count of the night. Leads to the first free pass of the night. Runners on the corners now in the top of the order. Bases versus a catcher in Kisner. Does that change what those signs might be, or is it just kind of blanket for who was ever on? Sosa can run, so that's what they would try to do in that situation. This one fly ball out toward left. Sosa is going to tag. 
De La Cruz ranging over. Throw is cut off. And moving up 90 feet is Dylan Carlson, who had a sack fly in the third inning. Takes one down and away. His 21st RBI. Let's go back to that. First, the base hit doesn't score a run. Tap or foul. And again, if you think it's it's 12 and under, it's 16 and under, it's baseball, right? Baseball will tell you, hey, there's certain things you have, as we've seen it, is the difference between a win and loss. There's the base hit. Garcia comes up throwing, it goes home, now to second, and they pick up another 90. Of course, the margin for error is just so thin. And you know what's more frustrating, at, at least for me, is you have Sandy Alcantara out there, who is a guy, and he's on the bump. Goldie. If you did that to Roy Holiday, they'd be scared to walk by him. And it's really, it's out of respect. It's out of respect for the pitch. And then again, I'm not trying to make this a, a, a and they don't execute. 100%. That's what you're saying. Yeah, yeah, you just respect them so much. That's what it's from. Sandy gets the strikeout as Goldschmidt switch. One total lie. Which one is it? That's inside there on Can I see that Nolan again? Can I, can I get a, a, a picture again of the true and what's not true? Yes. Mo momentarily. Okay. We had. I'm going that he didn't play for the Miami Flamingos. Broken bat, roller towards short. Miggy's got it, and Arenado is retired for the first out. You are going with which one now? I'm going no Flamingos. None. Jeez. But he got in eventually. Juan Yepes out toward left field. That is going to get down, and it one hops the wall. Yepes on his way to second base with another extra base. Right idea, just not the execution. So another extra base hit for the St. Louis. On a hop, Mickey bare hand throw to first. He did it again. He another great play. He makes it look easy, but not so much. According to fan graphs, he is the national respect he deserves for how good he is defensively. He makes every play he is supposed to make and a lot of spectacular plays, too. For Sandy. But he also gets angry. Kind of like Sandy. Yeah. Yeah. This, this run of him against his former club of the Cardinals is that he's, uh, you know, we said coming in, he's the first four starts against St. Louis. That's to Miggy off the bat of Sosa. And one away here in the seventh. This is becoming a nightly occurrence. Well, Allstate, you see the logo. They have two hands in the logo. And, well, what do you got? Pretty quickly. Fouled straight back off the bat of Kisner. Strikeout, a walk, and a run scored tonight. Come in on either sack flies or RBI base hits from the one and two hitters in the lineup. And Kisner is aboard for the second time with a base hit into right field. Jazz Chisholm Jr. still leading National League second baseman. Now I don't know exactly what star game. Yeah, well, he could still get voted in, but might not be able to play. But both top two uh, went on the IL today. Luke Williams. Recalled from Triple A Jacksonville. Went. Drove. Somewhere. He drove. Drove. He drove. Okay. That's to third for Anderson. Miggy turns the double play. We will play at a 1 3 1 ERA. And once again, the theme continues. Sandy is. It's, you know, it's so frustrating when you see those numbers and you think, how can somebody have that kind of ERA and. 
not have won a game. I mean, that's tough to do. It's the unearned runs. It's been the unearned runs that have gotten them. One unearned run on the board tonight. Mentally unearned run. And again, it's a very different game. And he seems to get tired as the game goes on because he's throwing only 99 miles an hour. <laughs> His next. Just 90. Four seam and sinker. He's got 15 outs between both of them. Kind of a check swing. Roller out toward Birdie. Out number one. But they're seeing Paul Goldschmidt. Broken bat to short. Two away. Yeah, that's what you call the old jam sandwich. Stephen Oker loosening in the Marlins bullpen. Available on a given night, but it is hard to find someone who's better than Sandy. Really is. And he started just slamming his glove, something you've never seen before. Well, we'll see. Ground ball to third. All the infielders tested in the inning. A 1-2-3 frame in, as it were, over the Marlins. So now Sandy to face Tommy Edmond. And that one misses outside. Third first base is Sandy. Up over 100 pitches to start this inning. Gets a bouncer to second. Birdie makes the play, and there's one out. Yeah, you know that there's certain people that you can almost kind of guarantee that they're not going to allow. Down low to Lars. One, two, three ERA in that inning. That one just missed low. 2 0 -oh pitch. Misses. As a manager, I mean, yeah. You see the velocity, you know. 3 1 to Newt Bar. Is down low, ball four. Give you 120 pitches every five days. Eventually, somebody else has to pick up the slack. And he had to leave him out there for another hitter because of the walk. But hopefully, no, you can't take me out. 0 2 misses up and away to Connor Capel. 22nd against the Braves. Also, a nine inning outing. This one up the middle. A base hit, and there are two on. in agreement of you. I just thought that that was a tough situation. But now the question is if we're going to sit here and, and, and play along with Donnie. Love screamed at me back to the dugout. On a hop. Birdie's got it. Rojas to first. 